Hey again, everyone. Today is Monday, July 20th, and this is the start of another week of our garden harvest. I uh, haven't gotten a whole bunch today, but that's okay. Uh, like I said in previous videos, we still have a ton more things out there uh, that are coming in at various times, and I'm okay with that because then I don't get overwhelmed and uh, bogged down by tons of things to do all at once. So I got three more cucumbers to make pickles. I got another lemon boy tomato and this one's so cute it's got a little point on it almost like a lemon. Isn't it cute? One little teeny tiny green bean and I got a dried bean. Let's split this up and see what it is. Oh it's a great northern bean and some more cherry tomatoes. It's a good thing um, because I made ketchup with uh, a, about six pounds of cherry tomatoes and I kind of made a dent in all the tomatoes but I'm still getting quite a few every day. So um, I will catch you tomorrow. Hopefully I will have some more um, cucumbers and some more beans coming in soon. I know that we have lots of green beans planted and they are uh, starting to get blooms on them so they should be producing pretty soon. See you tomorrow. Okay today is Tuesday July 21st. Yes 21st and this is my harvest for today. Bunch of cherry tomatoes again and one great big huge cherry tomato. Last year I planted some very large cherry tomatoes and this is one and this is one I believe that uh, came up volunteer from last year and uh, these are the big husky tomatoes. I think they're called super sweet or husky something like that and then these are just the regular cherry tomatoes patio tomatoes, I think is what they're called. Um, so I'm having a lot of fun with the different varieties of cherry tomatoes, and they're all delicious. Got another lemon boy, and I just think this is so cute with the little, the little tip on it that looks like a lemon. <laughs> and two more little, my little cuties, my mini eggplants, and two more these are the straight eight cucumbers that I've been harvesting early to pickle. So um, I'm going to go ahead and put these away. I just washed them and I'm going to add them to my collection and I will see you tomorrow. Okay, today is Wednesday, July 22nd and I'm going to do my haul video, I mean my haul video, sorry, my harvest video a little bit differently than what I have been. Um, I've put this on a video before but I just want to explain what happens when I uh, get the fruits and vegetables from my garden and I do this with my produce that I get from the store too. Immediately after I get them, I run a sink full of cold water and I add a splash of white vinegar and I just let them sit for a little while, maybe 10-15 minutes and then I uh, scrub them with this little brush if anything is really dirty like this tiny onion. <laughs> Um, if it has dirt on it, I will scrub it off. Um, I don't usually scrub the tomatoes unless it, they have something stuck on them, like some leaves or something like that. Um, most of the time there's not much dirt on the tomatoes. And then I just rinse them under clear water. So uh, let me go ahead and show you what I got today. It's, uh, as I said, it's Wednesday, it's pizza night, so we're going to have um, homemade pizzas tonight, so I got some basil from the garden for the margarita pizzas. Um, we got two cucumbers for pickles, got one Bradley tomato that is split, um, and so I wanted to go ahead and get it, even though it wasn't a 100% uh, ripe as dark as dark red as I wanted it to be. Um, I went ahead and pulled it anyway. 
another little tomato. I think this is also a Bradley. It's a little smaller, but I got it anyway. And then, like I said, my onion. The top part of it had died and it just wasn't really doing much of anything. So I went ahead and pulled it and I will put it in the windowsill with my others and um, let them dry and then I will use them. And then I got some cherry tomatoes. Not as many as I usually get, but I got about two good hands full. So I'm just going to rinse these off with in some cold water, cold running water, and then I will let them dry and put everything away. I do store cucumbers um, and I will store the basil in the fridge. The tomatoes I do not store in the fridge. I have two big bowls, one for the bigger tomatoes, the slicing tomatoes, and one for the cherry tomatoes. So I will stick all of those in there and then I go through that a couple of times a week and um, anytime I'm using the tomatoes for something I will always make sure I grab the ripest ones so I will flip the bowl over and <laughs> get from the bottom and um, just making sure that I don't lose any tomatoes because we worked way too hard on this garden to lose anything. So, Alright, well I will get this done and I'll be back tomorrow for our harvest. Hey guys, um, today is Thursday, July 23rd and this is my harvest for today. Um, got three more little cuties little baby eggplants, uh, two more good sized cucumbers for making pickles, and hopefully my neighbor will bring me some more of their um, bigger cucumbers because I'm picking all of these to make pickles <laughs> instead of picking them for slicing, but that's okay. Um, they are all delicious. Got another one of our little uh, Carmen peppers. These are Italian sweet peppers, and I don't really know exactly what I'm going to do with these yet, but I've got a lot of them out there, and I have one in the fridge that I picked last week that uh, I'm not sure exactly what I want to do with it yet, but I will find something to do with it. We got one more little green bean. Um, I ended up cooking the green beans that we had in the fridge the other night. Um, and it was so funny because I just uh, broke off the stem end and then broke them in half. And I sauteed them in a little bit of butter and put in a little salt and pepper. And put them in a bowl and it was maybe like quarter of a cup <laughs> and my husband laughed because he said these are all the green beans <laughs> and I said for now they are but we have lots coming in and I did look at them today and they have some pretty good sized pods on them they're not ready to pick and I do need to look and see which ones are um, the dried beans and which ones are not. He, he did a little chart and I need to look at that so I don't pick the uh, the dried beans and try to eat them. Uh, <laughs> but uh, so we, we got a big laugh out of the all of the green beans from our garden didn't even so far haven't even made a quarter of a cup. But they were really good. Um, then one little Bradley tomato that wasn't quite ready but I picked it anyway. I don't know why. I can't resist sometimes. And then all of my little cherry tomatoes. And then last but not least, I got some more dried beans. Um, let's see what this is. Uh -huh. I think they're black beans. It's hard to do with that. Yeah, black beans. Awesome. Good. I'm ready for some black beans. I did plant some more um, and I think this weekend I'm going to go ahead and pull up all of our carrots and um, 
plant some beans in those. So, um, well, I will see you tomorrow. These are more black beans also. Um, I'll see you tomorrow with, in our show you our harvest video then. Thanks so much. Okay, today is Friday, July 24th, and this is my harvest for today. I got some more cherry tomatoes. I got three more cucumbers. These are perfect size for pickling. I've already washed them, and I'm going to stick them in the fridge with my others, and I should probably have enough to do um, another quart of pickles today, um, so we'll, we'll see if I can get that done. I got another little baby eggplant. <laughs> These are just adorable. And uh, my colored bell peppers are starting to come in. I got uh, an orange one the other day that was on a previous video. And I got a yellow one and a red one today. And I could have probably left these on another day or two, but I just couldn't help myself. I went ahead and pulled them. And then, last but not least, I got all of these carrots. Uh, I still have quite a few carrots in the garden, and I'm going to go ahead and pull the biggest ones this weekend. Some of these, the small ones came up as I was pulling the bigger ones, um, but um, that'll be alright. It'll still be a nice little bite, and I am using the greens. So, um, I'm going to pull up the rest of the carrots if I can get all of them in, that are in a good size. I'm, I'll probably leave some of the smaller ones in. This is the funniest looking one. It has two legs. and <laughs> That's okay. Um, it'll still eat well. And so, I think I'm going to just pull up all the carrots and then put, the, put some beans in that space, those spaces. So I will see you back tomorrow with Saturday's Harvest. Okay, today is Saturday, July 25th, and this is my harvest for today. I got three more cucumbers, and it's time to do another jar of pickles. I'll probably do, um, probably do a quart jar again. Um, I've got enough cucumbers, I believe, to do that. Um, and I think they'll probably last me a little bit longer. I got some more cherry tomatoes, of course, and two more Bradley tomatoes. Three little green beans. Yes, there are more out there, and they're coming in, but they're just really slow. Oh, that one has a bad spot on it. I'll have to cut that off. But um, they've been really good. One little lonely carrot. I didn't really mean to pull this, but I did accidentally. Another little, pretty little eggplant. I just love these things. And I know I said I wasn't going to have any more beets, but my husband found some more beets. <laughs> uh, this is a pretty good sized one. I wasn't really aware that the ones that were still in the back were this large. I knew that I had a couple like this that I was just going to let go, but I didn't realize I had any this size. So, so I'll add that to the collection. Well, this is the harvest for today, and I will see you tomorrow. Okay, today is Sunday, July 26th, and this is the harvest from today. I've already washed everything and I'm getting ready to put it away. I have two red bell peppers and one yellow bell pepper. Aren't they beautiful? I love bell peppers. I'm so excited. I got one big, uh, one cucumber for pickles. I got some cherry tomatoes and two smaller tomatoes, two smaller Bradley tomatoes. <laughs> And the rest of the green beans are finally starting to come in. So I got just a nice handful of those, and I will add them to the collection of the rest of them. And pretty soon we'll be eating fresh green beans. Well, thank you so much for watching, and I will get another video, uh, harvest video up next week. And um, 
Really appreciate all of my subscribers. Thanks so much. Fly high, Pooh Bear.